Welcome. In this tutorial video you will learn how to open a scan project, connect VirtuServe with IntelliCAD or GSTARCAD in this case, use scan data for drawing layout plans and elevations, and how you can edit macros to adopt them for your own needs. Since um, the IntelliCAD packages and also GSTARCAD don't have their own point cloud engine and since they are not able to load any laser scan data within the systems, we use Qubits VirtuServe to um, work with laser scan data in IntelliCAD packages. So I will open my scan project from the recent project list and select two scans with shift and left mouse button, right click, go to true color, open them both or I can just double click on a scan in the scan project explorer to open it and I can switch between scans um, using the scan map. In order to connect these, um, my VirtuServe window with GSTARCAD, I will open the Send to Windows macros bar opens on the right hand side and you can see some predefined macros four of them are meant to send to Excel sheets or these three down here are uh, prepared to send uh, distances and coordinates to a text document in Notepad or also in Word and these two are made for sending um, XYZ coordinates into any uh, CAD system in the way that we first send the X coordinate, then a comma, then Y, then a comma, then Z, and followed by the Enter. So this is how you can create macros for your CAD system. Those two are prepared already. Now we need to connect our VirtuServe with GSTAR CAD. So I go to the connect button down here, take the finder tool, press the left mouse, drag the finder tool to my GSTAR CAD and release the left mouse button. And the connection is established. So now uh, in, if I want to draw the outline of this room, I go to my IntelliCAD, start the line command, switch back to VirtuServe and as I want to draw a 2D plan I will just send 2D coordinates to my CAD system so I hit the XY CAD button and start drawing by picking two points on each wall in my scan data and you can see on the right hand side in my CAD system the lines are drawn immediately. So, and I stop the macro by pressing the button again, go back to GSTAR CAD and press escape or C for close. In this case I will just play, press C. There we already have the outline of our first room. Now if we don't want to switch that much back and forth between the CAD system and VirtuServe, we can also create uh, macros with a new macro button. Um, I can, for instance, create a um, a line macro. Type in the text for the button up here. I could also define a raster image to be the icon for this command and copy the line as macro name as well. I could also add a tooltip. I can adjust the size of the button and you can see how the size changes down here. And um, what all I type in here um, is been transferred in a copy and paste manner to my CAD system. So here um, I just enter the command line and it will be sent into the command line of the CAD system. I say OK and save it. To run the command I can just click on the macros button and pick somewhere in the scan. 
and you see the command has been sent to my cat system. Um, what is miss still missing is um, the enter so I need to go in here once more and enter a space, say OK, then I go in here, cancel the command, go back in here and check once more. So pick somewhere here and the line command has been started. Now I can send 2D coordinates once more, so let me draw the outline of the neighboring room. I will start in this corner, pick one point, pick the other point, go by, continue over here, and so on and so forth. If you continue like I have just shown, you may end up with a finished uh, layout plan like this one. You can see that you can also insert blocks uh, starting the insert command in your GSTAR CAD or IntelliCAD and then use the XYZ coordinate macro from VirtuSurf to place it. You can also um, fill in um, numbers for elevations or width and height of doors using VirtuSurf um, um, distance measurement tools and copying the numbers over to your GSTAR CAD or IntelliCAD. Um, also with line commands etc. you can draw stairs and make your layout plan complete. The same way you can also um, create of course elevations from laser scan data. Thank you for your attention and if you want to learn more about how to import scan data and create your own VirtuSurf projects and if you want to learn how to create your own macros, you may want to have a look at our other tutorial videos in our Kubit TV channel.